Hey you guys and welcome or welcome back to my channel. My name is Leanna and I am back with another video. So first, let me show you guys my current obsession for the spring and summer. I promise you guys, I have like found a scent that I have fallen in love with. And it's crazy because this is not usually my scent profile or I just really hadn't found a scent from the scent profile that I really fell in love with. But this one I fell in love with, you guys. This is 2D Fruity Candy and I only have the lotion. I've not tried the body mist and i decided not to buy the body mesh lately i've like started falling in love with body creams especially the ones from victoria's secret this is a bath and body works video but the body creams from victoria's secret are so strong they project so well and that's all i need to layer with my perfume that's what i've discovered lately so but back to bath and body works this one is one that projects it smells so good the notes in this one are sweet jelly beans mixed berries and sugared lemon now i'm not big on i've never been big on jelly beans so i couldn't tell y'all what a jelly bean smell like i don't know if this to me smells like candy for real it smells lemony to me it's like a sweet yet tart lemon that doesn't make sense but it's the truth it's not as sugary sweet as lemonade um the lemon is quite tart but still there's something sweet about it and i do feel like i get berries too if I smell it long enough, it smells kind of like candy, but it's just so tart. Y'all, I have bought four bottles of this because I love this and because <laughs> I have some perfume that I love wearing with this and I feel like this is so perfect for the spring and summer, you guys. It is very ladylike. I'm gonna say it's very ladylike instead of saying it's girly. I know, it's tutti fruity candy, right? It sounds very youthful, it sounds super playful, but you guys, this is so delicious and i'm in love with it i am not a fan of lemon fragrances usually most lemon fragrances smell like cleaning products to me but the fragrances that i've been smelling lately have been right up my alley they smell really ladylike i've already worn this one like at least three times and that is unusual for me because of the fact that i do have so many fragrances and not only is it because i have a lot of fragrances but it's also because every day <laughs> I feel different. I wear my scents based on my moods, but I this is just so beautiful. It's just a very uplifting type of scent. It's bright, it's sweet, yet tart, and it just smells so good. It's the type of fragrance that makes you walk by someone and you're like, what is that smell? What smells so good? What are you wearing? Like, it's that type of fragrance. And I like this one a lot. Okay, so next we're gonna hop right on into my next current obsession and I say it's an obsession, but I only wore this for the first time yesterday and oh my god, I fell in love. Like, can somebody please tell me why I didn't already know about this one? Like, I knew about this one and I smelled it in the store, but I remember smelling it for the first time in the store and I felt like it was generic. The notes in this one are sugared red berries, blushing freesia, and rose meringue. Y'all know, if you don't know, I do love a good rose note. I thought that this was generic the first time I smelled it, and then I got it, and then I wore this, and I paired this with my Fenty whipped body butter. The first time that I sprayed this on yesterday, I was like, hmm, this smells like very similar to winter candy apple. And I still feel that way. When you spray this initially, the opening smells like winter candy apple, but not as strong. But when this dies down, oh, it turns into this beautiful, pretty girl scent. It is very girly, but I feel like the rose in it makes it ladylike, but it's a very light, sweet, yet fruity scent. And I'm in love with this. I'm in love with this. Um, I've seen people compare this one to You're the One. I disagree. It might be similar, but to me, they don't smell the same. To me, they don't even have the same vibes. It's just, a lot lighter it's more flirty it's more girly it's perfect for everyday type of wear and it reminds me more so of winter candy apple it's not exactly what like winter candy apple is just more like it in the opening it dries down into its own fragrance and it is just like creamy it's floral it's sweet it's fruity it is so sexy i really like it i think it's light and flirty fun perfect for a day date for people who do signature scents i feel like it would be a great signature scent for day dates like making your man remember you when he smells this fragrance like ooh, that's that's what my girl wears right there 
And I also think it would be great for, you know, intimate time. It's, and I feel like this name for this one, Gingham Love, is just like perfect. I love this one. I also feel like the packaging is even perfect. It's just like, it's light, it's simple, yet it's sexy, it's romantic. And I really like this one. I don't know. Have you guys smelled this one? Like, let me know what you guys think about this one. If you smell like all the gingams or just any gingams in general, what's your favorite gingham, if any? Because I don't like the original gingham, but I haven't smelled it in a while. I know that when I smelled it back in the day, I didn't like it. I feel like the original gingham is just like a very light, non-offensive fragrance. I'm gonna have to go back and smell that one. It's been a while since I smelled it. That's just what I can remember from my thoughts. But this one, I love. I did pair one other thing with this as well. This is Among the Clouds. Um, I did do a review on the body spray before. I took the body spray back and I was like, let me try this again. Maybe it's good for combos. I still am not the biggest fan of that body spray, but I have it. And I also got the um, perfume, a small bottle of perfume, because I was like, maybe this will last longer. I do love the lotion still. I think that the lotion is like perfect for the springtime. It's another one that is, it has like a citrusy scent. And I described that, that note to my nose kind of smells lemony. So yeah, and it has vanilla in it. And so I do like the lotion. It's very light. It's perfect for the spring and summer and would like go with a lot of fragrances. But this smells really good. I ain't gonna knock it. Like the perfume to me smells better than the body mist. I feel like I could smell the vanilla more so in this and the body mist to me is like way more citrusy. And it's very light in the vanilla area. It smells very light, very citrusy, very juvenile. If we're being honest here. And I keep trying to get what everyone else gets with the body mist, but I just don't get it. And it's a purchase that I regret rebuying if I must be honest and I'm thinking about gifts in it but I want to give it more time because I want to see if I can get it but the perfume definitely smells more perfumey it definitely smells really good it's amped up the vanilla um I don't remember what the notes are in this one at all I know that there's vanilla I feel like there's berries in this the notes will definitely be on the screen somewhere because I don't remember yeah this smells good the vanilla is definitely better than this I didn't try it on my skin but I sprayed it on my clothes. It was the last thing I sprayed. I put on the Fenty Skin with Body Butter Cream. And then I put on the um, Gingham Love Spray. And I was like, oh, I smell good. But I felt like I was kind of missing something. So then I sprayed them on the clouds on top to try to give me that like vanilla, that deeper type of uh, vibe. And it was smelling really good, right? But it disappeared. <laughs> so I feel like it didn't last that long. I was smelling Gingham Love longer than I smelled this one. Next oh my gosh another obsession you guys the stuff that i was buying this was stuff that i just didn't have before and it was stuff that i was not interested in getting before and i was happy with most of the purchases that i made i feel like i found some gems sun blooms and suede i wrote this one off in a store when i smelled this um collection in a store i was like no 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 sun blooms and suede was another one i smelled in the store and i was like i can't smell it I did smell it more than the other one, but I still feel like I just didn't smell it. But I got it because they were having a sale and I just needed to buy some stuff. So I tried this one on and I was like, what? I love this one. The notes in this one are white raspberry, pink petals, and vanilla cream. Oh, good. It's another beautiful ladylike scent and I feel like the bottle, again, the bottle is perfect for the fragrance that is in here. It is so ladylike. It's light, it's inoffensive. This is a very good light raspberry. It's nothing like that raspberry mess that they brought out a few months ago that I hated. You get the vanilla here. You get the light floral. It almost even smells like there's an apple note in this. It's kind of sweet. It's a bit deep from the vanilla, but very light. This is another one that's perfect for a day date. It's perfect for intimate occasions. Um, Oh my god now i will say it is quite light but i feel like it's one that if people are close to you they're gonna smell it's another one to me that has moderate longevity it doesn't disappear like the other one does it lasts but it stays very close to the skin it's a nice light fruity floral with some vanilla added on top this is another one that you would want your partner to remember you for and it's another great one for like intimate days as well and if you work in an office it's very romantic but i feel like this one would definitely be a nice light fragrance for the office as well 
again because of the fact that it is so very ladylike gingham love is more flirty this one is more classy type of vibes so i feel like it would be perfect for going in the office so next you guys this is fresh jungle rain the notes in this one are rain kiss palms dragon fruit and misty breeze i don't know the note of a breeze smells like maybe like air <laughs> i don't know anywho um this smells a bit candied yet fresh yet watery and when i put it all together it smells like a bit of a candied laundry sheet i'm not really big on smelling like a laundry sheet if i must be honest but i do like this one it smells like i think because of the dragon fruit it smells like candied it's a bit salty a bit airy it's like being near a big body of water and then you got that candy dragon fruit and i don't know what's giving it the vibe of the laundry sheet maybe the breeze is giving it the laundry sheet vibes and the rain kissed whatever is giving it that body of ocean vibes i find it interesting and i would like to smell it on someone else it's just not a fragrance that i would care at all to smell on myself and i almost kept it but i was like girl you're not gonna wear this anywho let's move on we've made it to the last item of this video i do have a few other things that i want to show you guys as well since i'm talking about this fragrance because i bought this two i bought this fragrance in two forms i have been preaching that i just hate this fragrance and i think it smells really weird but i got it this is into the night i don't know what the notes in this are but of course they will be across the screen i remember the smell of this i hate it <laughs> i felt like this smelled like urine a bit and now that fragrance is interesting to me not that i love it or anything it's not amazing but it's interesting and i feel like it would be great to wear at nighttime and great to pair with perfumes and other stuff like that so i got it oh it's so pretty on my skin <laughs> there's raspberry i think in this it is fruity yet what is this note in here that it's just odd is there coconut in here i have to look at the notes but there's definitely like raspberry it's a bit dark it's a bit mysterious and i like it and i kind of want a full bottle i might return this one and get a full bottle but we ain't gonna say much more about that because oh i hate loving things that a lot of other people love i like it a lot it smells good it's making my legs shake and i like it and i really want to wear it on a date with like a sexy dress on and since we're talking about that let me show you guys the last few things that i have because they are the most exciting things to me you guys i'm kind of embarrassed but I had to do this these are all lotions period lotion gang 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 okay because i feel like i need lotions for all occasions and i know like a lot of people don't like lotions but i don't care i love them and i feel like that means there, there's more for me even though i'm not gonna buy no more <laughs> this is pretty much all i need i just got makeup on this white one so i got some for all occasions i got into the night i got this and i smoked it and i got this one because i felt like it would be sexy for wearing at nighttime with like my nighttime fragrances and i want to shine at nighttime and i want like there are times when i wear like my sexy deeper deeper fragrances and i wanted a lotion to match with them and i felt like it's the night would be the perfect lotion for them and then i got it and then i smelled it and i was like this does not smell like i remember it smelling it smells a whole lot better my nose has changed my nose has grown a lot and so i got the body mist fragrance anywho this one is a thousand wishes this is for everyday wear like i love to shine at nighttime but baby your girl want to shine all day i don't care i want to shine all day oh, perfect girly type of fragrance to wear this is perfect perfect lotion to wear under your girly fragrances you're the one i bought a backup of this because i already had one so i got a backup of it and oh my god i love this sweet strawberry rosy fragrance in it beautiful this is for your more more romantic fragrances at nighttime and so the night is for your more bad girl fragrances this is your romantic date night fragrances and then i got coco paradise even though i don't love this fragrance mm, i like it in this um lotion form and i feel like it would be great for wearing with my coconuts because again i want to shine all day especially like if i go to the beach 
I'm gonna need it to shine. I don't care. I'm gonna have glitter all in the ocean. That is all for this video. I don't have anything else to show you guys. There's nothing else to see here except for maybe another video of mine. Let me know what you guys thought about any of the products that I've shown. If there are any products that you are interested in having me review or look into, definitely let me know. I will try to purchase it and let you know my thoughts on it. Until next time, you guys. Bye.